Hey Davis, I got a personal question for you. I understand you had a big moment recently. Can you talk a little bit about that? Yeah, so I, I got engaged Christmas Eve. Um, and so, uh, yeah, it was, a, it was a big moment for sure. How long did you plan that out? Uh, well, we've been dating for six years this month, so it's been a while. But um, I think I, I asked her dad for his permission um, on our bye weekend, so okay. Halloween. How was her reaction? Oh, uh, I got her good. Did you? She, she didn't see it coming, and um, she kind of freaked out a little bit, which was a little scary, but uh, it was good. It was good, happy emotions. Cool. Well, talk to us a little bit about, obviously, you guys have Cade running the show now. You know, DJ was one of the big leaders. Are you taking on more of a leadership role with DJ um, going? You know, I'm, I'm just trying to stay the same. Okay. You know, just be me, um, and, and hopefully, you know, just me being me, um, I can help impact guys and, mm -hmm. and motivate guys and uh, just be an example of what the standard is here. Um, you know, I don't think me or really any other guy on the team has to change the way we've been doing things and how we've been leading just because you know, DJ is not here anymore. Um, you know, we just need to continue to be ourselves and not help you get enough. Have you seen anything different from the offense the last couple of weeks with, with Cade running things? I mean, honestly, not really in a good way. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we we just, business as usual. You know, we, there's a standard that's got to be, you know, uh, uh, you know we, we've got to practice to a standard. We have to play to a standard. Uh, and that doesn't change. It doesn't matter who's running the offense and, and who's coaching. There's a standard. And uh, everyone knows that. And, um, that's what we've been doing the past couple of weeks. You talk about the standards. You've been here when the standard was really, really high. I mean, the standard doesn't change, but when the results were, were different than they have been the last couple of years, do you see the program kind of headed back in a, in a different direction? Yeah, I mean, we obviously went through a little adversity last year and, mm -hmm. and you know, had a couple of bad weeks this, this season. Um, but. I think, you know, the standard hasn't changed since I was a freshman. You know, the standard was the standard before I was even here. Um, and I, I think next year the team has, you know, the potential to, to make a run for it, uh, the whole thing. Uh, I thought this year the team had potential to do the same thing. Um, it's just a matter of, you know, I don't know how it is. It's just a matter of executing. Um, but uh, I definitely think the team definitely has the potential to, to make a run for the whole thing next year too. What's it gonna be like to put that paw on for the for the last time? Uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be a mixed emotions. Uh, you know, it'd be a little sad for sure. Um, but uh, I'm nothing but just just thankful for the four years I got here and the, the opportunity I got to to be a part of something bigger than me. And um, it's been an unbelievable four years. And uh, you know, I'm truly blessed to, to have experienced this in my life.